<laughs> All right, morning guys. Pretty much picking up where we left off uh, for yesterday's vlog. Today is day two, and we are heading back to the zoo, and maybe checking out the Natural History Museum to go see some dinosaurs. But either way, I, I told you guys that I wanted to uh, show you guys the hotel room because it was really nice. Stayed at the U.S. Grant Hotel yeah. here in San Diego. It was awesome. And they gave us a free they gave us a upgrade. Free upgrade. To like a, a suite. Yeah, and I oh. we we told them it was our anniversary, but I bet they just upgraded us because just because it's just a random thing to do. But anyway, let me show you, let me show you guys around. So here's the here's a big old. Big old double beds, so you got the bed that you sleep on, you got you got the bed that you throw all your junk on. We packed up a little bit in anticipation for this, but um, and then they gave us like this little, I don't know, little other room to chill in, so we hanging out in here. Got Had my computer set up there, got a nice little windies, some good light coming in, and they got a little table and some chairs, and they, they sent us, of course, you know, it's, in, in, it's desolated now, but they sent us some uh, chocolate-covered strawberries and Pellegrino, because they know we get, like to get wild with that uh, sparkling water, we like to turn up, you know, oh, wow. so that was really, really sweet of them, so yeah. thank you guys for that, and then the bathroom is a lot of fun, too. It's, um, it's nice. <laughs> and then, so it looks pretty good in here. And then they, you got the uh, the Roman the Roman spa style uh, <laughs> uh, shower stuff. So I was like, Jenny, we need to get when when we when we make it real big, you know, when we're when we're super old peoples who are who uh, you know made it made it rich playing um, you know video games that just get piped straight into your head. You know, the next the next level of streaming or whatever. You know, we get to upgrade our showers or whatever else but i still think i might want to get one of those shower heads one of those square shower heads for a house right now anyway so yeah that'll be fun but yeah anyway our our, st our stay was incredible thank you us grant for that yeah and i uh, just want to show you show you guys the room before we get going but uh day one was a blast hope the, the vlog is probably already up so hope you guys enjoyed that one thanks for watching and we'll see y'all at the zoo all right guys made it to the park and uh first before we go visit the cheetahs and stuff i gotta go get some food and i also had to give me a hat so you got my or your Jimmy's Russell bro hat, so a good a good buy. But we're also checking out the lizards and stuff. So right now we're watching this big fella just sort of pace back and forth. Now obviously with like the little snakes and everything, I'm like there's a bunch of little kids around, and this guy was thinking he might like to eat one of them little guys. So he's kind of been pacing back and forth. That is a very big lizard, the Komodo dragon. It's pretty freaking awesome. I bet he could really get moving if he wanted to. <laughs> He would not. Yeah, he would. No, he wouldn't. I wouldn't let him kill us. Oh my gosh. He would, look at the, he's just muscle. He's, he, is, he is just a big, gigantic thing of muscle, but I wouldn't let him kill him. Kill us. I mean, if oh you. Oh my gosh. One bite would just get you like. Oh, well, yeah, one bite gets you all infected and stuff and poisoned and whatnot, so. Gotta keep that little head away from you. He's gonna, gonna come back over here. But yeah, he was pacing back and forth real fast when there were all the little kids around. <laughs> he was following this one in particular. He's and like, I, was I like, think. You keep putting them hands up little, there. Teeny tiny little boy that huh? was just like so happy, and this lizard was just following. He's like, him. I think I might want to eat one of you guys. Big boy. <laughs> yeah. Big boy. Look at that. That's pretty freaking cool. <laughs> like I used to. Please let me out. I used to know all kinds of stuff about these guys when I was little. They're pretty cool. So good, good, good start. Yep. Watching the moving over towards the cheetahs. Yeah, yeah watching the Komodo dragon stalk the little kids. But yeah, <laughs> I, I'm glad I got my hat. And it's time to go check out some cheetahs or, or, or whatever's next. We'll see. So I was saying that that guy might not be able to kill us, but I mean, it, they can grow to be like 10 feet long and like 350 pounds. And at that point, it's like, well, <laughs> you may get <laughs> maybe <laughs> that'd be pretty scary. So this is like probably one of my sister's favorite animals ever. We, I got I got to tweet her a picture about this. Let me see if I can show you. Look how teeny tiny he is. Let me let me see if I can get in the shade so that uh, you guys can see him better. Look at that little guy. Look at that little guy. A little fennec fox. He's so teeny tiny. He was sleeping. Oh, he's, now he's gonna get up. Oh my. Maybe not. Maybe not. It's scary out there. Maybe. Oh, hello. Hi. Are you gonna get food? Oh, look, there's another one inside the cave there. Do you see inside the rock? I do. Are you gonna get some food, little guy? Yeah, there's one in there. Right there. He's in there somewhere. Are you gonna feed him? Oh my goodness. I'm gonna go get him a little hole so you can feed me. <laughs> that is so cute. Oh my gosh. <laughs> He's like, I know I am. It's a trick question. Do I get to go in? It's a trick question. Oh my gosh. 
a good baby. You gonna go in? No. Sorry. There we go. One of them's name is Evie, which is pretty funny. <laughs> I'm working on training them up a little bit. Good job, dudes. They are so cute. I was just happily sitting in the sun. Yeah. <laughs> Good job. And sleepy in the sun. Little, little cat foxes. <laughs> Check out these little guys. What's up? <laughs> just scampering all over the place. What are you doing over there? Hi! <laughs> what kind of monkeys are these, Jenny? Yeah, little spooter monkeys. Spider, monkey. Sp right. spider squirrel monkeys. Squirrel. <laughs> they got little yellow fur, looks like. Hello. <laughs> what you got there? <laughs> no, this is not for you, guy. You got, is that like a little egg? Like a little hard boiled egg or something? Yeah. Is that what that is? Get that. Get that. So let me have some of that, dude. <laughs> He's got a stick and a hard boil and a half of a hard boiled egg. <laughs> He's got to figure that out. Good job, dude. So he pulled out the little egg yolk and then he was using his little sticks to eat the egg yolk. He was like putting the egg yolk in it and then using his sticks to eat the egg yolk off of the sticks. That's pretty neat. <laughs> using them little tools. Good job, dude. Well done. <laughs> Smart little minkies are using their tools and ma it made me just only a little bit sad that they were taking most of the egg whites from the hard boiled eggs and just like chucking them. <laughs> they don't want that, they don't want that protein, they don't want them gains, they want that, that healthy fat for their brains. And I just want my camera to focus. <clears throat> it's figuring it out. But the monkeys definitely figured it out. They said, give me them, give me them egg yolks. <laughs> the, the what? Ex excuse me? <laughs> I'm 12, by the way. Check out this guy. Obviously caught her attention because it looks like a kitty. He's got a super tail. Look at him. Look at, look at that tail. But he's not a kitty or a dog. He's so cute. I'll go show you what he is. No matter what, he's so tired. Little puppy cat. <laughs> oh, puppy cat. Yeah. Little puppy cat. Look at that. His tail is almost as like as long, longer than he is. Puppy cat. Yeah. It's a fossa, not a cat or a dog. Is it a fox? They they belong to a small family of carnivores. Huh. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Have fun. There's the Hello. ocelot. Hello. We look at you. I'm doing my little cleaning. Leave me alone. Hello. You are so beautiful. That is a pippa cat. That's a pippa cat, yeah. That is a jungle beast. Oh my goodness! Look at those markings. Oh, you are beautiful. We just we just come to the zoo to look at the big cats. <laughs> We're like uh, to, to come baby talk the big cats. <laughs> Wow. Hi. Oh, work on that day a little bit. Good Look job. at this fine specimen. Hello. You are beautiful, Mr. Bird. <laughs> Pretty bird. Yeah. Do you, you know how many times I hear So that. many people do that to so me. Many people because it is true. You are a pretty bird. <laughs> just, just hanging out with the penguins. No big deal. <laughs> There's some of them swimming around there, too. You can see him down there. There he is. <laughs> oh, he's making. Oh, that's another one. Yeah. I'm making my move. Say, hey, I'm going in the house. Bye. When is it gonna be? When are you guys gonna give me some fishies? Look at these guys. Well, hi, he's hanging out. This guy's. He's chewing on some string. Can I give you a picture? Good job, dude. There's some very pretty birdies. Oh. <laughs> showing off for you, doing some cool tricks. Oh, no, he's hiding. Goodness. No. Hello. <laughs> oh. Guys, just tearing it up. <laughs> oh, oh my don't drop it. He's like, no. No, this is my string. Hi. Okay, look at that. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> like a little sleepy alien bear. That is so cute. A little koala bear. He's so, so tired. All these babies. <laughs> oh my gosh. That is just too cute. And there's three of them. There's one to our left, and there's one kind of way over there. I don't know if you can see it, but he's got his legs sticking out. <laughs> They're so cute. Yeah, they got a couple of them, huh? Oh my gosh. Jenny's flipping out. His little leg is just kicked out. Yeah, the one to the right, his leg is kicked out too. Oh my gosh. That's so cute. Check out the little wallaby down there. <laughs> just chomping away in the shade. <laughs> 
at those big old kudos. Or rhino rhinoceri or whatever. Big fellers. Just hanging out right now, but kind of hop on one of those bad boys and ride to Orgrimmar. <laughs> Check them out. Check that out. They finally get to see the cheetahs. And they do, they have they have their little dog friends just roaming around, hanging out with them. <laughs> oh my goodness. He's like, oh, I got a couple people coming to hang out with me. Hello there. <laughs> wow. That's pretty cool. Wow. <laughs> yeah, and then not when he's gonna bite anybody, the little kid is worried. The dog? The little kid is worried that one, that one of them's gonna bite each other. They're no, they're buddies. It's like, come here, buddy. Hey, guys. <laughs> Look at the puppies. Hello, everyone. Hello. This is my cheetah. You me too. <laughs> Check this out. They're like born in the same year, and they, you know, they have their particular buddy that they're like. I think we we were looking at Miley and Baka there. I think. Yeah. They're also born in the same year. That's pretty awesome. <laughs> so just. Over there, just chilling in the. Here comes Miley. Can you come check on things again? There's Miley over there. There's Baka. That's pretty funny. It's awesome though, for sure. <laughs> check these guys out. <laughs> There's a lot of them. They're all just kind of hanging out. Whoa! He says, "What are you doing? I might like to get you." Oh, hello. Hi. He says, back it up, guys. This is my turf. You look like you might be a big one. Yeah, it's a tough guy. Hello. Whoa, hello. We don't we don't have we don't have no food, no breadcrumbs or nothing. We're following the rules. They're just kind of slowly walking around their pool. Yeah. Check. You, you stay over there. You, you stay over there. No, you stay over there. You stay over there. I'm getting all riled up, oh my goodness. It's about to go down, I better turn this camera off. <laughs> Look at this kangaroo. There's a red kangaroo just getting its rest on. Jenny says this isn't, looks like an old lady. You think she's pretty old? Her name is Jira. Jira, ba, Jira. <laughs> J-I-R-R-A. -R -R she's not very old, she was born in 2005. Okay, I mean that's not too, I mean. It's a 12 year old kangaroo. Yeah. Getting some rest. Got some little paws, not paws, but little hands crossed, whatever those are. <laughs> Rest it up. Check these guys out. Now, I don't mean to sound stupid, but it's crazy to think that like animals like this actually live on Earth somewhere. These big, weird creatures. Nikki. They are cool, though. <laughs> wow. Two years old. It's her birthday. <laughs> Oh, there you big dinosaur cow horse thing. <laughs> dinosaur cow horse. Dinosaur alien cow horse. He said, what you say to me? <laughs> what you saying about me being an alien wow. dinosaur cow horse? Wow. Did you get a cool picture of that one? Yeah, I think so. If I wasn't shaking too bad. <laughs> looks like the Kodos are up front at them. I know it doesn't actually work that way, but it looks like they have like armor plating on them. Looks really cool. Big strong animals. It's really neat. There's his buddy, looks like he's even bigger. Look at them big fellers. They give him a break and we're tight. That's crazy. Lumbering along. I don't know. Jeez. Look at this bear playing with his ball in the pool. He almost he just stood up and like almost chucked it out of there. Get a hold of that thing. Good job. <laughs> wow! He's running? Wow! <laughs> My goodness! He's got all kinds of cool tricks to show us. Do it again. <laughs> Do it again. Whoa! Whoa. <laughs> Do your thing, buddy. Panda! Maybe not. Nice try, guy. <laughs> I can still see the panda. Because Chomping on him some bamboo or something. Good job, buddy. Kind of messing around with their pandas. We were looking at like the exit, looking through the exit, but they got like a whole big old thing for pandas. Let's go check it out. He's coming to see you, Jenny. Wow. It's showing off. 
That's some pretty cool swinging moves there, guy. <laughs> Check out the sun bear. Looks like he's got like himself like a little chicken or a turkey or something. Cleaning off his face. Having a good day. What do we call her? What do we call Lily little sun bear. And that's what there's an actual sun bear. <laughs> Alright guys, so the zoo was awesome. We saw the cheetahs. We pretty much saw everything. There's no baby cheetahs out on Not display. this time. They do have yeah. baby cheetahs though. But we saw pretty much everything, I think, in a day and a half. Yeah. We could have done the whole thing in one day if we really wanted to. But up next is... Dun, dun, dun. It's a dinosaur. Dinosaur. So this, look, they say 20 big steps. Let's count. Ready? Dino One, steps. two, I'm just kidding. <laughs> we'll see when we get there. <laughs> so we're at the museum. We're not seeing the dinosaurs yet because we got the ultimate dinosaur experience. And for the ultimate dinosaur experience, you have to go down to the basement. But if you go to the basement, you can't come out of the basement. Or you can't go back into the basement. So we said, okay. We're going to look at some other stuff. So looking at the big scary kitties. I actually kind of like the art on this, on this thing. Check this out. So there's the wolf, which is a smaller skeleton, and then the saber-toothed tiger. Which is a bigger skeleton. And over here, they're fighting some of our prey. That'd be pretty intense, man. A pack of wolves kind of competing with the saber toothed tiger pride. And then, of course, there's this mouse that's like, please don't tell them I'm here. <laughs> that's pretty intense. Check this out. That is ridiculous. This jaw could go that wide. And then, chomp. Yikes. Gigantic sloths. Just ate a bunch of billion different plants. Pretty big, pretty big creatures, but fortunately they didn't eat meat. There's a manatee hanging out right there, and then it's like, whoa, that's a big manatee. I don't know. Are they that? Are they that big? Like always? Prehistoric ones. Okay. This looks more like a what I would imagine a manatee size, normal size to be. Yeah. And they got them big guys, them prehistoric ones, man. Seems like a lot of stuff was, was bigger back in the day, but. That's the mommy, she has fingers because she grabbed plants. Oh. That's why she had fingers Huh. Yeah. Speaking of big spooky stuff that you can see in the ocean. <laughs> Jeez, I mean, guys, you can tell me, do, do great white sharks actually get this big? Cause that's it's a teenager. That's pretty spooky. The mom was twice that size. No what? Is, is this like a prehistoric one? Well, it, 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 well, it's a dinosaur. Jeez. That's that's so this okay. So this is like the the old, the two million old sharks. This is a teenager. The, the mom was twice as big. Yikes. Okay, so here's the chart, right? So here's a person, and there's the great white shark that's kind of around now, and that's its tooth. The one that we're looking at up there is uh, that big, and then there's the biggest one with the biggest teeth. That's just ridiculous. That's the adult. Yeah. So this one is a teenager. Yeah. So it would have got up to this. Jeez, so it's like 40, 40 feet long, 12 Almost meters long. Feet. God. All right. You, you, I mean, if you see this coming at you, I mean... You don't really just want to call it good, but, you know. Here's a dinosaur. An Albertosaurus, a little bit more agile and quick. Hello there, Jennifer. There's a, there's a wild Jennifer. <laughs> a little faster than a T-Rex. That's pretty cool. I, I used to know dinosaurs. all kinds of stuff about dinosaurs when I was little. Check this out. Whoa, dude. <laughs> That's pretty cool. This one, too. Keep an eye on them, keep an eye on them babies. That's pretty neat. Check this one out. I'm pretty sure. To, is this an Ankylosaurus? If my memory serves me correct. Where, where are they? Let me go check this out. What? It didn't say. Which, which one's this one? Ankylosaurus. It's gotta be. I don't know how this one fell in the ocean and got chomped up by a shark, but I was. I think I was right. Here's the Notosaur. And there's the Ankylosaurus because it's got them big ol' thing sticking out of its back there. My, my little my little kid memory served me correct. I'm proud of myself. <laughs> this is the sad part. And the dinosaurs and everybody else all dies because they got hit by a meteor. Very sad. But you can look at the this thing right here. It's like the, the dirt. You can, you can tell the difference between like what happened before and then it's all just burnt to hell. <laughs> Everybody's just hanging out. Look how big that meteor must have been. 
That's crazy. Oh no. I remember watching, I've seen about a hundred billion interpretations of this event. There are videos of me being a little kid and watching this stuff. Of course the rats survive because they get to go underwater, or underwater, underground, and then just eat all, eat all of the dead stuff. You gotta be resourceful, man. And small, that helps too, I guess. Get this thing out. It's, it's getting ready to knock this one over. Oof. I feel like it probably, it probably should have knocked it over already, but it looks like it just turned it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> How close it's getting. <laughs> so if you go all the way upstairs to the fourth floor, all the way in the back, up a secret staircase, you get taken to the dragon's den. That's pretty cool. You get the history of serpents, as it says in there. Of different dragons, this one's like. <laughs> Look at that face. Ooh, <laughs> I'm a dragon. The true history of dragons. <laughs> then this is, but like I said, you have to go to the tip top of the museum yeah. to get to here. It's the secret place. <laughs> People writing books, just making stuff up. <laughs> That's pretty much what's going on here. This book. Books about just made up creatures. I like that though. I do. Because this whole area is like, um, this whole area is like about all, like, like these books that people wrote like, you know, hundreds of years ago about like, you know, science books. Like, so th th here's this plant. I named it this, and here's what it looks like. Here are its characteristics, that kind of thing. What's this? So, like, there's mermaids. There's like, seahorses. yeah. So, about mermaids and seahorses. That's like funny. Dogfish, birdfish. Like, what is the, what, is, what does That's he think? The dragon. What does he think this is? Like a, like a sea bat or something? Uh, like a, it was a like stingray. A stingray? Yeah. Interesting. That's what they're thinking. Yeah. That's pretty neat though. Yeah. Ultimate dinosaurs. Whoa. Mala. Look at that big guy. The what? Malasaurus. Malawisaurus? Whoa. Look closer. And what? No thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this. Tyrannosaurus. Yeah. This guy. Yeah. Little thumbs. Yeah. Little thumbs? Yeah. Make use of them guys. Big tall dude. Oranosaurus. The Oranosaurus Rex. <laughs> this edgy guy who probably found this fossil. Dang. Sure is a deep fella right there, isn't he? Kakara, do not. Yeah, the Kakara don't. Saurus. Don't. Mm. Which one's this guy, Jenny? Such wow. The such wow mimus. Suck a mimus. Something. Something mimus. We'll go with that one. It's a cool oh, guy. That was close. Suck a mimus. I'm right. Pretty close. Whoa. Looks like a lot of these guys are from Madagascar. This is the Majungasaurus and the Repetosaurus. They're about to chomp on you, dude. He's about to chomp you down. Look at this. That is a big guy, though. He's 26 feet high, but he, he looks little. Yeah. You know? well, he doesn't have, look, he doesn't have like all his feet and stuff. True. And he probably, his neck probably counts for some of his height, too. I would bet. Where's the Majungasaurus? <laughs> there he is. How tall is this guy? Eight, eight feet, feet tall yeah, so and 26 he's feet he's long. Jeez. But he's like really, uh, look at his little baby hands. His hands are funky. Look at him little funky. What? He's got knobs. No. Yeah. No. Yeah. Look at him. That is funky. Just little like eight. Wow. Yeah. This little dude. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> the Sigma suckers. He looks like he would tear stuff up to like a Tasmanian devil. Yeah, he talks, you know? yeah and talk shake it hit. That's, that's like a honey badger. He'll probably jump right for your throat and start making fun of him. And the Masiakasaurus. The little. Masiakasaurus. I'm, dude, I'm so good at these names. I would, I would just pick him up under his little belly and hold him. Come on. Cat. Come on, Masiakasaurus. Come on, Dad. <laughs> Let's go hunt some small critters. 
together. This is a vertebrae of some sort. That thing is magnificent. Look, okay, so look, there's there's Jenny, and there's this. <laughs> I'm as big as its vertebrae. One. Yeah. Like just one. Argentinosaurus. I wonder where that came from. Look at that thing. That has a huge neck. Dinosaurs are just weird. They got this may have been the teeny, largest tiny little bodies and then gigantic long necks here. to get that, and that huge tail to counterbalance. Wow. <laughs> That's the kind of thing you build in Spore. A little teeny tiny arm dinosaur guy. Look at them little dudes. But, but if you're gonna make fun of him, he's gonna bite your head off, so I wouldn't, wouldn't make fun of him too much. But yeah, they're just like little vestigial bird wings, I guess. And they turn into gigantic I saw Beasts. a cartoon one day that it's pretty showed intense. T T Rex sitting on a toilet. And he's looking over <laughs> yeah. the toilet paper roll. He's like, little short arms and he had this uh -oh. look of anxiety <laughs> on his face, like despair. Yeah. <laughs> this guy would probably have a similar problem. Look at, look at those little chompers. It's a little extra creepy right there. Look at look at the drawing. Oh, the, wow. They got him complete with it with the chompers and everything. They haven't found his skull though. Oh no. Fossils are missing. Oh yeah? So how did they know? I don't know. That's interesting. Margosaurus. Got the best smile of all the dinosaurs. <laughs> kind of outgrows the kids pretty quick. They're pretty, you know, pretty close. All right, all right, we can still be friends. Um, um. <laughs> Giant Titanosaurus. Just the leg bone right there. Give me some of that. Give, give you an idea of that one. Look at that. Wow. Jeez. Big filler. Velociraptor. The raptors are so neat. They're really cool. All, of course, you hear about the velociraptors hunting in packs and being all smart and I stuff. Think they're like one of my favorites. Yeah, they're pretty cool. The of course, like you got the, the big ones, and there's there's a big one right there that we're gonna look at in a second. But the raptors are pretty neat. Not quite as small hands either. Got even got a little claw on there. Do they have a claw on their thing? Oh yeah, they do. That's pretty cool. Oh my goodness, Gigantosaurus. 12 feet tall, 46 feet long. That's pretty intense. Pretty big, oh my goodness. Look at the sound effects of him snarling and stuff. Not, not small hands at all. Not really, I mean, once again, his arms probably aren't gonna be that big of a use, but I mean, every snatch if you wanted to. Or just stomp on you. Look at he's got like almost like opposable thumb claws there. Yeah. Look at that. That's crazy. Big boy. There's some serious chompers right there. Serious chompers. There's a little representation. <laughs> that little thing in front of him's like, oh no. Dang it. Dang it. <laughs> bad spawn. I feel you. Yeah, bad spawn. I feel you, dude. Wow. All right, sweet thing, back on the road. Oh yeah, we that had, was awesome though. Yeah, I had a good time at the zoo, and then I think that was like a nice little finishing touch going and looking at some dinosaur bones and <laughs> feeling like a little kid again, be like, oh my gosh. It's so big. <laughs> but uh, we're gonna probably head on back to the vehicle, maybe pick up something to eat along the way. Actually, we'll see, we'll see what we wanna do. We'll but figure it out. Either way, we're gonna go home and see them kitties. I'm get, so happy. Get settled in, see what we wanna do for the evening time. But either way, it's been a lot of a lot of fun hanging out with you guys. It's been a great trip in general, and I hope you guys have enjoyed the videos along the way. And as always, thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll see you guys next time. Peace!